Hey everyone, Michael Short here. Come on, let's go outdoors. There is no question that when you mention walleye in Alberta, it uh, invokes many different types of responses from we need to have uh, opportunity to catch more fish, to keep more fish. Can we put fish in different water bodies? And the list goes on. Well, an interesting development took place on Traverse Reservoir that is going to see, if it all works out, it's going to see walleye populations being increased in a very new and innovative way. On May the 1st, a unique project rolled onto the shores of Traverse Reservoir a mobile fish hatchery operated for the very first time in Alberta by the Alberta Conservation Association. While the system performed well, it wasn't without its hiccups. The team faced mechanical issues along the way, but quick thinking and technical know-how kept things on track. Then, earlier than expected, the hatchery team got their first big milestone. On May the 18th, walleye fry began to emerge. Just three days later, more than one and a half million fry were successfully released back into the waters of Travers Reservoir, making a significant achievement for this pilot program. With the project considered a success, the next steps is a full debrief and the development of work plans for future sessions. If all goes well, this could be the beginning of a new tool in the province's fish conservation strategy. Well, no question this could be marked down as a big success for the Alberta Conservation Association and perhaps the start of something big. Till next time, everyone, I'm Michael Short. Come on, let's go outdoors.